Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I always do this. I'm like, welcome. And welcome to the last episode of Skincare Sunday. If you are new to my channel, make sure you check out the other three skincare videos that I have. So every Sunday for the month of January, I've been posting a skincare video. So make sure you check those out. Also this shirt, is from Toby. So for today's skincare Sunday video, I'm going to tell you, I think five? Five of my favorite skincare products. So these are items that I have not talked about before in any of my other skincare Sunday videos. So let's get started. The first one is going to be a good moisturizer for your skin type. As I have mentioned, Ole, which I just found out you actually say Ula, Ula Henriksen. I've just been saying Ole because it's O-L-E, but apparently it's Ula. So I guess we'll just start saying Ula. Ula Henriksen. It just sounds weird. I have talked about Ula Henriksen before, but this is a different moisturizer that I have. This is actually the first one that I started using. This one is very similar to that smaller one that's in like the little round container. This one's very similar to that one, except I found this one is a little bit thinner than that one. So that one's just a little bit thicker when you put it on. This one is so thin, soaks up right away. So this is the Counterbalance Oil Control Hydrator. So the reason I go with the balance line again is because I do have like oily skin here and I have very big pores. And this line is supposed to help minimize those pores and mattify your face. Make sure you do your research into different types of like moisturizer and stuff like that try stuff out that, to see what works with your skin because not everything is going to work with your skin like I remember when oh, what is that brand called there was a really popular brand that was going around for a while Shea Moisture I think it is and everyone was raving about it saying like how good it was for their skin when I use Shea Moisture I broke out like crazy so don't just think because it works for someone else that it's going to work for you make sure you try out different things but so far Ola Henriksen Ula fuck. Ula Henriksen has been the best moisturizer the best moisturizer I've ever used okay number two is going to be another Ula Henriksen product. This one is the Pore Balance Facial Sauna Scrub. I do keep it in the box, but yes, I have used it a bunch of times. I love this thing. So what's in it is Volcanic Sand, Green Fusion Complex, Neem Seed Oil, and AHAs. Man, this is so good. So this is an exfoliator. I only use this once a week. This will give you soft skin. I actually think I talked about this in a favorites video, so I might have lied about you've never seen any of these products before. Oops. Anyways, you can use it two to three times per week, but I tend to use it only once or twice because I do have my little Foreo device, which you would have seen in my last Skincare Sunday video, which is my evening routine. And you can't use this with the Foreo because it is not good for it. You're not supposed to use any scrubs or anything with that device. So this is a, another type of way to hydrate your skin and that is by using essential oils. So you would have seen in my first skincare Sunday video that I use tea tree oil and grapeseed oil and I mix those together and I use that on my face. But this is another oil that's great for your face. So this is jojoba oil. And this one's actually good for your nails and your hair as well. So you can like put it at the ends of your hair, rub it on your nails. A nail care video is coming because I have a lot of nail tips. Because my nails were destroyed by, what are those things called, gel nails. So I'm gonna kind of like take you through the process of healing them. Anyways, different video. So how I would use this is after washing my face with a cleanser, I take that oil. Sometimes I'll mix tea tree with it. You don't have to, you can use it by itself. And you just like massage that into your face and then just like wipe it off. Just like exactly like I did in the first skincare video. So just watch that one if you wanna know how I use that oil. The next two products are some of my favorites. And I got both of these for Christmas. I have my dad to thank for this one. This is the Health and Beauty Aztec Secret Indian Healing Clay. Now I do not know how my dad knew about this clay because this has been a very popular skincare thing that I see everywhere. So I don't know how he knew that this is a quality product, but he knew. He got it on Amazon. World's most powerful facial, deep pore cleansing, 100% natural calcium bentonite clay. This will also make your skin so 
soft. Now, I try to use this once a week. Honestly, I don't always do it once a week because it's kind of a process. Like it starts in a powder, a powder form, and then you have to mix it with water. You know, I think all the plays are like that usually, or most of them at least. It's good for facials, acne, body wraps, clay baths, foot soaks, chilled clay for knee packs and insect bites. Wow, I didn't even know it was for all those things. I literally just use it on my face. Cool, cool, cool. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. I love this stuff. It's great. I don't know if it actually works really well because I don't know my skin's been pretty good lately But I can't just say oh, it's because of this because I also follow a strict skincare routine And I do all those things every night and I use my Foreo device So I can't really say this healed my skin because I don't know so I'm not gonna like lie to you and be like Yeah, this this is you need it. It's just it's good. Oh, jeez a good facial that doesn't break me out because I find some like face masks really break me out or like dry out my skin a lot whereas this one does not last but not least is this little guy so this is the Mario Badescu hopefully I'm not butchering his name but Mario Badescu drying lotion and do not shake it I know it's all very confusing on how to use it. I was really confused on how to use this at first too because it was like, oh, don't shake it, but make sure you dip a cotton pad into the pink area. And I was like, sorry, how? But to use one of those little earwax cleaner things, you know? You'll, you'll see when I show you how to use it. But this is for like um, whiteheads. That's what it's best for. So just anywhere that you have like a little breakout, like I usually get all on my chin. You take a little bit of that, put it on, you leave it on overnight. I find it doesn't make a mess on my pillowcases at all. Like when I wake up in the morning, I can't see it anywhere. And it, even though it comes off my skin during the night, I can't find it on my pillowcases. So I don't know where this goes, but it like disappears. It's been great so far. Sometimes I'm not gonna lie, I do wake up and I'm like, wow, that did absolutely nothing. But it is really good for like small white heads. So if you have like big cysts, like deep acne, it's not gonna work for that or anything like that. It'll only work for like, surface area like a tiny bit of dirt whitehead trapped under the skin that is all it's gonna work for so don't buy this if you get like those if you get really big pimples or like deep cysts or anything like that because it will not work that is more hormonal like what you put in your body type of thing pretending like I know what I'm talking about those are my top five must-have skincare products I'm sure it will change within the next year or so so maybe I'll do an updated skincare Sunday couple of videos at some point I don't know let me I need to stop kicking my room light let me know if you want to see any other skincare videos. I'm kind of running out of ideas. That's why I only made this skincare Sunday thing one month because how much skincare can you really talk about, right? Thanks for watching these videos, guys. If you watched all four of them, you're the best. Thank you. I appreciate it. If you liked this video slash if you liked this skincare Sunday series, be sure to like this video as it really supports my channel and subscribe if you want to see more videos. Bye guys. What is this? Oh, it's my hair. That was part of the shirt. Ah, I was about to rage.